What's up, BMW fans? Check this out. This is the all-new 2024 BMW i5. That's correct. This is 100% electric 5 Series. It's the first of its kind from BMW. 5 Series has never been a fully electric, but now it is. Look at this beautiful illuminated grill. Wow. Stunning. You got the new headlights there with the arrows. Very nice. The whole car is redesigned. Everything is brand new on it. From the hood, you see these nice grooves in there, very similar to the iX. The bumper is very aggressive. You got massive air ducts in the front for the inner cooler and the, um, the oil cooler. You got the side vents there for the drag, for the drag coefficiency. And you got some vents there for the actual turbo inner cooler, but not on this model because it is electric. On this model, you will actually have some more vents on the side there that allows air to come in for the intercooler. Now, let's have a quick look on the outside here. Wow, these are nice wheels. Love the five spoke that switches up into a double spoke, so make it like a 10 spoke kind of. I don't know, I don't know how to explain this, but it looks really nice. You gotta see this in person. Beautiful red caliper brakes on the beautiful adventuring red here. I think it's adventuring red. You got the nice new five designation logo there. You will see that the doors and the body lines kind of squared off. They made the door handles flush with the actual door. That's better for, um, for aerodynamics and for fuel efficiency. You got the new redesigned rear taillights. Redesigned everything, like the whole car is brand new. There's nothing different, there's nothing new. Ah, I'm sorry, cancel that. There's nothing the same from the previous 5 Series model, especially this one, because it's full electric. That's what the key looks like. You got the nice all black key with the M logos there, with the M color, it's very nice. Super sleek rear bumper, no exhaust. That's a reverse light. I don't know about you guys, but I am really liking this i5. Looks awesome. Let's have a look at the back. Well, let's check out the charging port. <laughs> yeah, no gas, baby. This is fully electric. Let's go. Okay, this interior is beautiful. I love this new stitching. It's like a diamond stitching. Very cool. Very, very cool. It's like a two-tone color. I'll go from the other side so you can have a better look at it. But again here, you got the leather going one way this way, then down through here. Aluminum grills that actually do illuminate at night because it is the Bowers and Wilkins sound system. Super nice. You got the nice new carpet lighting on the ground. That's different from before. You can see the design there. And now inside, we have this new LED light bar that goes across the entire door, the entire dash, across the whole front of the car. And you see how it's pulsating there? That is beautiful. Wow, it just turned to green now. Wow, I am just blown away by this car. This carbon fiber here, is spectacular. I am a huge fan of carbon fiber and they kind of changed it up just a little bit. It's hard to tell in the video, but can you see those little silver points? Like wherever the cross weaves are, there's like little silver in there. So it's kind of like carbon fiber mixed with some metal. I don't know, you gotta see it in person. There's a better shot there. Just beautiful. If you're a fan of carbon fiber, you have to get the carbon fiber uh, package in this vehicle. Of course, you got the iDrive 8.5 in here, which is really nice. You got some widgets here that you can quickly access. You can also quickly access your climate, sorry, your navigation. This is your climate. You got the home, you got all the apps which has like literally everything from a drive recorder to games to navigation to Wi-Fi hotspot, interior lighting, interior, interior camera, like just wild. 
uh, you got your mobile device there, and then you also have your music. Very nice. Clement's always here, so you can always adjust it. That's really nice. You got your wireless charging here, illuminated uh, cup holders. If this looks similar, it is because it's from the iX. Very similar design with, with the volume here, quick shortcuts here, and the glass dials. Got your new shifter. Let me switch over to the driver's side because I'm getting a lot of glare from the sun there. But this gives us a quick look at the outside again. I am in love with that illuminated grill. It looks so cool. I mean, when this thing drives at night, it just screams, get out the way. And now a look from the driver's side. Wow, this is stunning. Look at this two-tone color. You know, BMW has always had this black. The carpet's always been black. But now you can see it's like, it's a gray. It's like a lighter gray mixed with this beautiful cinnamon type of leather. I think it's cinnamon. It looks cinnamon to me anyway. The floor, it's not black, it's like a its like a very dark gray. Hard to explain, you gotta see it in person. But it's different from any other carpet I've seen from BMW in the past. You got the driver door card. Hockey stick handles. I'm pretty sure these will be changed. Now, what I'm showing you here, this is a pre-production model. So, Maybe some things will change, like on a 5 Series, I find it hard to believe that they're going to leave this plastic, especially on the i5 M60 where you've got everything metal and carbon fiber. Why would they do that plastic? So pre-production, that might change. I have a good feeling it is going to change. you got your light controls here with more carbon fiber. you got the massive, I don't even know how big screen this is, but it goes from the driver's side all the way to the passenger side. Really nice. Um, yeah. You got your boost here, same thing. It'll give you uh, some extra horsepower for about 10 seconds when you hold it down to pass someone or just to accelerate off the line. You got USBs here, USB type C. You got some more USBs in the back, which I didn't show. You got a USB up here with the travel package so you can put in like a coat hanger, table. There's a bunch of attachments you can buy from parts. So another USB there, one more USB there two more USBs there. That's a total of six USB type C's. You can charge the entire family and more. You got these touch uh, panels for the uh, rear climate control. So you got the heated seats in the back. You can adjust the fan, the temperature. Very nice. This is a really nice car. And totally forgot to show you guys inside the trunk. Pretty spacious. And the charger. It's just like your regular iX charger. And you can switch this from a 120 volt to a 220 volt, which I believe is in here somewhere. I saw it, here it is. There you go. Let's have a look at the engine. Just plastic covering, but what you have underneath here, similar to the other platforms, you got your air conditioner here, you got your battery management there, and you got your electric motor there that's hooked up to the axle. Awesome. Well, this was Andre from. BMW Auto House and if you like this video and you want to see more cool BMW videos make sure that you're following us and you hit that bell notification until next time peace out